Hi there. Hope you are doing very well and that 2023 is treating you well. And if it hasn't so far, I just hope that you can take care of yourself and that the year will start treating you better soon. <laughs> so for today, I wanted to just do a more casual video. As you saw in the title, I want to just do something with a bunch of different fabric sounds, but I'm also going to be over explaining each item that I'm going to show you today. I'm just going through and using the combo of fabric sounds and chatting and over explaining, bring you a nice combo of relaxation and hopefully a little bit of sleep. Almost all of my items are kind of more of a clothing item. I believe that one of them is a non-clothing item, but I really like the sounds and I think you'd like it too. So, why don't we get started right away. I'm going to go in here with my adorable cow slippers. They are so warm and so comfy. I got them for Christmas and I've been wearing them basically ever since. They are this fluffy material on the sides here. Don't mind if they already look a little dirty, <laughs> but they are so cute and fluffy. They've got the black material that is all their spots, as well as their eyes. They've got different dark and light brown coloring on their noses, their ears. Sorry, I'm trying to find a hook to hold this and the darker brown on their horns. They're so fluffy. And then their fluffiness is on the insides too. They've just got a black, oh you don't look how dirty those are on the inside. They've got a black, softer felt material on the inside and then on the very backs it's just white as well with an open back for your feet so they're an easy slip on one I won't really show you much of the bottoms because they're very dirty but they're then just like a rubbery material with a back and forth zigzag pattern or some grip, which I find handy on my hardwood floors. Oh, they're so comfy. This feels like I'm petting or scratching one of my pets. <laughs> it's just that fluffy. Okay. So those are items number one. Now I have my winter gloves. probably seen these if you've seen my, some of my past videos. I think I've worn them in maybe at least two of the videos so far. Particularly in my uh, winter cabin video, patching you up in my winter cabin. That was both one of my favorite videos ever to make. It was so much fun. And I had, was using these gloves for the first time in an ASMR video. And I realized that they... 
made such good, like, crinkly but soft crinkly sounds. So, let me put them on here. So, ever since that video, I realized that I really wanted to use these more. So, that's what I've been doing. They are a brand I don't really know of, um, but they're an Eau Claire, Eau Claire brand here. They've got it in white lettering. It's kind of like a mountain triangle symbol. This is over a adjustable Velcro section here. Just so that you can tighten or loosen the part that's right around your wrist as they be. They've also got, well, it's on this side, but they've got little clips. I don't know how well you can see that there, but that just keep the gloves together when you're not using them. They are very basic black, but they are very warm and soft on the insides with some great layering on the outside and kind of um, your typical winter... I don't even know what type of fabric to call it, but that type of waterproof fabric. And I don't know if you can see, but there it's plain black in some spots, but down the uh, in what is that your far left finger here to kind of round the top of your hands here on both sides, it has that. It's just more of another triangle-y pattern that's incorporated on the glove, so they're not entirely plain. And now on the inside is the cool feature where they've got these interesting grips on your, I think it's your index and your pinky finger, um, both sides there. And then on the rest of the glove, it's got this um, more rubbery texture, which I believe is for better grip. So they'd be great to wear skiing or sledding, things like that. So that's the winter gloves. Moving on to another wintery item that actually also was in my uh, patching you up in my cabin video. Uh, it was a wintery themed video, so I had very wintery themed items with it. This is like this very wintry hat. It's super warm. It is in kind of a navy blue tone. Uh, the outside is this. Again, that wintry fabric. I don't want to call it polyester, but a fabric like that. And then as you can see here on the front and the sides, the inside is full of this fake fur, fluffy warm material in this brownish blackish color. And then it's got this awesome uh, clip attached to the two ear flaps here that just oh, I can do it right. Clips in so you can adjust it as tight as you want. So this winter hat is really good, I find, if it's like extremely, extremely cold out. It's definitely not an everyday hat, <laughs> for sure. It's also got these two uh, adjustable ear flaps, because I believe there's a way to clip it on the sides so that, oh yeah, it's right there. There's a way to clip this guy and this guy up somehow, so you could also clip it up on the sides there. So if you wanted the warmth of the hat, but you didn't want the uh, uh, super warmth on the sides of your hair. It's a very nice uh, one. It's called Snow Tech. I don't know, the brand name. 
Oh yes, and a cool feature on the back that I've never seen on a, another hat before is an adjustable um, kind of, I can open it, clip there. So you can tighten and loosen. tightness on your head as you need to be. So it's very helpful for that. Flip it inside out. I'm sure you could technically wear it inside out as well. It wouldn't be as worn as the black liner you see here, but do the job. Okay. So that's the last, I believe, of my wintry items. Let me just grab uh, my second last item for you, okay? So I have here a beautiful silky robe that has been featured in quite a few of my uh, ASMR videos at this point. It's a great sounding trigger as well as it's just very soft and cozy and very aesthetic to look at. see here. You probably won't even see the full thing all at once, but it's very long. Um, comfy. It's got one, two pockets here on the front. I don't have it on right now, but these are the loops for where the tie will go. There and right here. on for a second, if I can. It's a very soft material that uh, is very, again, colorful, aesthetic. It's very pink in this kind of baby pink color almost with these well, you can see, but there's clouds in the background, fluffy white clouds with these, I believe they're blue herons or they're cranes. They might be cranes, I can't, I'm not really sure, but they're cranes with the blue heads, the long yellow beaks, their feet as well are very young, long and yellow. And they have gray and white wings. There's also some slight patterning as well behind them. That's kind of this uh, fine line style in a grayish green color. It's just a fun pattern. from wear and tear, but it's obviously been well loved and cared for. So soft. It's like my slippers almost. So, it's a great material. for you the last item. It is the only item that I have that's not a clothing piece, but I thought that, again, it makes some great sounds. It's very huge. <laughs> but I have here for me my favorite sleeping bag for camping. I'm sure you can see it. It is a very neon bright orange. 
material. It's got where is it here? A black zipper that goes all the way through the top. To the bottom. That's the bag. The inside has an extra layer that's this dark, dark blue. Almost like a royal blue. That goes kind of from around the hood as a seam, as an extra warmth seam between the zippers. All the way down. The sleeping bag here. And then the inside is just all black. The material is a very warm. Um, I don't even know what this material is. It's uh, more like a fabric material, but the inside is almost like a down material, so it's a very warm type of sleeping bag. And it's got the two zippers here that go all the way so that it's really adjustable. And then it's also got the brand here. It's a Mac, it's Mountain Equipment Co-op uh, on the little zipper zipper side. The fabric-y uh, velcro. That's the word. A velcro tag here. That just goes right over to seal in the zipper. And the zipper also has the symbol MEC on it. The brand. Yeah, as you can see, the bags had some uh, kind of tears on it a little bit that I've keep uh, kept, sorry, let me sell them. It's got some like discoloration happening just from being washed and used at doors a lot. Um, this thing's probably as old as me, but <laughs> so it's lasted a long time. It is a awesome, awesome, awesome item. I love it and I keep repairing it because I never want to get rid of it. It's a really good brand and if it's held up this long, then that is fantastic. The other thing to show you on it is it's got um, this awesome hood so you can fully zip yourself up in it. It's super, super cold. It's got these flaps that you could put up, up around your neck for extra warmth. And then it's got a little adjuster here. So you can tighten the head part as tight as you want it. So if it's a very, very cold um, evening, um, camping, then I can adjust it. Needed. all the fabric-y items I have for you today. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this very relaxing. If you'd like to see more fabric -y videos, some uh, themed fabric -y videos in the future, you can let me know. Thank you so much for watching, for all your support, and I will see you later. Okay, take care, dear. Bye now.